According to a report in Variety, director Edgar Wright and actor Johnny Depp have entered into talks to join the upcoming 20th Century Fox film, Fortunately the Milk, based on a children's book by Neil Gaiman. Fortunately, the milk is told from the point of view of a young boy and his sister who listen as their father recounts the story of exactly what happened when he stepped out briefly to purchase some milk. That story includes aliens, pirates, piranhas, and of course, time travel. John Byers saw the sounds of Fortunately, the milk with Edgar Wright and Johnny Depp involved. I totally buy it. I think this sounds delightful. I really do. I think this sounds like it could be a really fun, charming book. Edgar Wright directing it, Johnny Depp on board. I'm, I'm finally able to feel a little bit excited about things Johnny Depp's involved with again after seeing his performance in Black Mask. Um, this sounds like it could be really cool. I also think it sounds like a movie that's going to make $8 million at the box office, but that's irrelevant. I, I think the movie sounds really cool. I'm excited about it, so for me it's a buy, Mark. See, I would buy Whitey Bulger reading the kids a story about <laughs> what happened when he stepped out to buy some milk. I think that, I, yeah, I buy this movie. There's there's a little bit of hesitancy when you just think of the, the quirky characters that Johnny Depp has done recently that haven't exactly you know paid off at the box office critically or in receipts but this movie i think could do very well depending on how it's released and how it's marketed with talent like johnny depp involved with somebody like edgar wright behind the camera i think this could do a lot of damage this could be one of the family films of the season whenever it comes out so yeah i'm, I'm totally you know what? you make a really good point that maybe my eight million dollars is off you you changed my mind you oh good yeah, i think I let's talk not, about the rate again. yeah i don't think <laughs> I, I don't think i buy this a whole hundred percent i don't think the johnny depp version of this is going to be that kind of I mean, if he was playing Bulger, that'd be creepy. Like, fortunately, the milk saved me. The first page. All right, kid, remember, yeah. if nobody yeah. saw you did it, it never happened. Don't drink the blood. <laughs> and then cut away to him drinking blood. Um, no, I think Edgar Wright, this material sounds perfect. And I think Johnny Depp will actually play, like, the regular father who all this crazy stuff is happening to. He said it before. He's doing a lot of these films now because he has kids and he wants to broaden the, his horizons. I think... Him just playing Johnny Depp it, and then being all these crazy experiences thrown at him and the way Edgar Wright directs sequences and scenes, this sounds like a lot of fun. It sounds like a great fairy tale, so I, I can't wait to see it. I, want, I wish it was out right now. Yeah, to, just as long as the aliens that he encounters don't turn his brain into the internet. Like, that, as long as there's no transcendence fingerprints yeah. in this at He has, all, like, I'm weird happy. braids that are, all like, microchips, like, in transcendence. I can, yeah. I can, for the, every time I think Johnny Depp, no, I just think of that, like, mm, that mopey face oh, on the transcendence post. I like, mm, I'm in a computer. Mm. That movie did uh, suck. You know what reminds, <laughs> this so reminds bad. me of, though? What was that based on a bunch of children's books... The one that starred Jim Carrey. Was Lemony it? Snicket. Lemony Snicket. Snicket. You know, I actually thought that one was a decent little movie, but I guess it just never did well enough to, to merit uh, sequels. This reminds me a little bit of that. And mm -hmm. I think if it can have that same kind of tone and flavor, I think good things could happen.